before getting with any work today, a little somebody is going to a settling in day at her new school. Where are you going? <laughs> yes, that's all right. Let's not dox the name. <laughs> She's there from 9.30 till 11, so I'll get back at about 9.35. I live five minutes away. And then we'll crack on and do some work. You gonna have fun? Yeah. So that's Ada all dropped off. A lot of people get sad and upset, mainly Emma, but I also see other people getting sad and upset about the kids growing up. But I can't help but see it in a different light. I see it as a good thing. I've done well enough bringing Ada up <laughs> to keep her alive enough to go and progress to all these different places. You know what I'm saying? Oh shit, I still haven't packed the clock yet. I suppose I packed the clock yesterday. I didn't do it, sorry Lee. Oh do that today yeah i've done my job the older she gets yes it is sad seeing her go from like the babiness but me watching her grow into a child and then a teenager and then a woman which is what i will see i love it absolutely love it right sales as always we'll start the day with some sales box e a b c d e which one's that for 13 pounds uh, for 13 pound and 49 pence we have sold the last final hick vision other bracket so we sold the small ones this is the last other bigger one 13.49 for 58 pounds 98 we have sold the second bt response 500 phone if you recall call recall these cost me five pound each from a charity shop they were 10 pound i was about to be reduced the next day so i said Oi! Reduce them today, please. And they said, okay. So five for each. 58 pounds and 98 pence. Beautiful. 10 pounds all in. Free shipping is a bunch of dinosaurs and playthings. Sold these once before. They got lost in the post. Four weeks later, they got returned to me. They turned back in the mail. So I relisted them and sold them for a tenner. I had to refund the customer, of course. But um, it is it is what it is. So I'm going to get those packed up. I actually want to get this clock on the wall today. I've got two places I can think for it. I just realised you haven't seen that clip yet. So take a look. Well, I've got to try and find a way to slip this into the video here somewhere. I've just had a package that says, keep doing what you're doing, wishing you all the success you deserve, Nigel and Claire. Oh, let's take a look. Let's have a look and see what this is, shall we? I actually have no idea, to be honest. Oh, is this the... It is. It's the clock. Thank you so much, guys. Yeah, boy, look at that. We've got a clock. So I've just sold this one, which I couldn't read and understand. So they said, I want to send you a clock, and they've sent me this one. Oh, it does take batteries. Perfect. I'm going to battery it. Yeah, sweet. I'll slip a little battery in there, and then we'll have that on the wall. So much easier to read. I'll go right there. Love that. Now, if I remember rightly, wait, did you send me an e did you send me that on Instagram or an email? I think it was an email actually. So I don't actually know if I've got anything to plug for you, which is even more generous. Generous? Generous. Let's have a look. Um, yeah, it's an email. So I think they are just viewers of the channel and not in this space of creating content. So Nigel and Claire, I do massively appreciate the gesture. I'm going to find a battery for that. I think I've got one in the kitchen in the boiler cupboard. Not that you need to know where it was. And I'm going to get that on the wall ASAP. Really appreciate that, guys. Very, very, very kind. My postman delivered the parcel and he went, keep doing what you're doing, wishing you all the success you deserve. I think I'm at the wrong address. Tosser. <laughs> One of the main points in the email when they reached out and said, I love your channel, etc. They said um, they really like the tip on the franking boxing of the green boxes. And I see what they've done now. I see what you've done. Quality. Good job. Very evil. <laughs> it's either going to go where my old one was just there, but it looks a bit out of place there. Or it's going to go up here to try and cover these holes to sort Macca's head out. He said he's sick of looking at them. So if it goes, if I can fit it there, I'll put it there. God love the man. But again, thank you guys. Really appreciate that lovely clock. It will go up today at some point. At some point. Today is also another. 
Today, again, is also another very itty-bitty kind of day. I hate saying itty-bitty, but it's anything that works. What can I say instead of itty-bitty? Itty-bitty's fine. So I've just dropped Ada off at one of her sort of settling-in days. She has a settling-in sessions throughout the run-up to her going to that school because she's moving into primary school. So half nine till 11. So I've got to be there at quarter two, whatever. Then she'll come home, have some lunch, get settled, get sorted out. Then at 4.30, she's got to be at a dance class. Then I'll pick her up at 5.30. 5.15, take her to a Nana's, and that's where she's gonna stay until Monday evening, today's Friday. So I'm gonna be sad without her, I am. So, but I'm also gonna be very busy. Like most people, I do relish having time on my own. I'm extra particular with time on my own. I'll spend the majority of my time on my own. As Project Game said, not only am I a silver fox, I'm also a lone wolf, and I am, but, I love my kids. They're just doing my head in. So although I'm going to enjoy not having to be responsible for a few days, I'm going to miss my kids. I'm going to miss them. Emma's been in Glastonbury since Thursday. She'll be back about Monday. Not, not giving her a second thought. Cut that bit out. Cut that bit out. Yeah, not bothered about her. So that's all the sales I've got there. I need to pack this up. Lee's going to be kicking my head in about that clock. Why have we not sent it yet? So I need to get that done now quickly. By the way, I'm going to draw the winner of the DS on the weekend's car boot sale videos. So you've got enough time after this video to go over to the Nintendo DS one, which is the rip off prices. No, which one have you not seen yet? I'll put a screenshot up here. Go over to that one after this video and make sure you enter. <clears throat> and can I also just address something very flipping quickly? Listen, I'm 36 years old, all right? When it comes to Toy Story, I am very aware that the name Andy should be on the foot, okay? <laughs> I said I was going to scrub these two names off, Sophie and Andy, because I am, because they're not supposed to be on there. These two are both penned on this is not an original andy look it's not legit it's been penned on same with sophie i am aware of these i know you're only trying to help guys but when you're telling a turtle to hide in its <sighs> turtles are old i was trying to make a what's it called a reference to being old but i am very aware these two are not supposed to be on there so they're going to get removed Oh, and while I'm thinking about it, I've also got to send out a pair of these North Faces. A lot of people ask me to buy them, so they're not for sale because I'm going to I'm gonna tear through these. I'm going to use them and just use them and use them and then replace them when they get battered because they're really lightweight and cool. But I've had a chap, John, reach out and he's got a what he believes to be a copy replica um, Adidas jacket. And like I've said before, especially with these, I've got no issue wearing reps, especially reps that are very, very plain or reps of a design that just never was made by the manufacturer. I like the bootleg stuff more. That's, I'm not going to get into definitions of fakes and bootlegs, whatever. But he wants a pair of them. I want what he's got. He sent me the jacket. I'm going to send him the trousers. So John, big up to you, my friend. I really appreciate it. His name on YouTube is ShedXL. So I don't know if he makes content. I don't think you do. If you do, I'm really sorry. I haven't looked at it yet. But, uh, but John, I massively appreciate it. I get them onto you today. I did forget. I've messaged him and said, shoot, I totally forgot. I'll do that today for you, bro. They probably might even already be there by the time this video comes out. I'm not sure if I need that clock. The packaging from the Flexi Spot is coming in clutch, baby. Double wall as well. Once I fold it over a couple of times, it'll be quadruple wall. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny, it's not funny. I might even just send it like that, Lee, you know. Just so it's got some... Shall I? I think I might, I just feel like the bigger the package, the more protected. I'm gonna be doing some retro watch-alongs as well soon. Some of my old videos. Uh, Jason was watching them and I thought, yeah, that's a good idea. 
my old videos are mega, as far as I'm concerned, mega cringy. But it's all part of the growth, so I can't, I'm, I can't, and I won't be ashamed of them. My first video on this channel, because I did reselling channel before, but I was doing it all wrong. I was filming that way, whatever else. I had like 26 subscribers, thought I was a don, and I had a very, very relatively successful fitness channel three or four years before that. My first video on here, if you go back and look, is my opening scene is I think. My name's Ricky. This is Ricky Resells, and I'm back. But not only were those words said, they were said in a very monotone, kind of, I don't want anybody to hear me outside this garage, voice. <laughs> but I'm not afraid, baby. I'm not afraid. Uh, John, there's your parcel. Clock, the clock's about here to here. <laughs> Two to five on that. I'm also approaching the end of my square folded Munbin labels. So I would then be moving, which I've had no issues with at all. I'll then be moving on to the roll in the roll holder, see how that holds up, see if there's any issues there. If not, it's going to be a 100% pass rate. So we'll soon find out. Link to my Munbin is in the description down below. There might well be another Munbin video coming soon, to be fair, because they've reached out and asked me to review their newest, latest one that's not even out yet. I've gone back to them with some different terms and just waiting to find out, really. I'm not really bothered if I do it or not. I'd like to. Be cool. Bit of dollar in it. But um outside of that. Last. But this weighs fucking 10 kilos now. One to two, I can take that. Probably would have been under a kilo if I packed it with less packaging, but it probably would have got there broke. And I'd have had a very unhappy Lee. Unhappy Lee. <laughs> Postage done. I think. And I've got to do the dinosaurs and the north face. Let me do that first. I love doing private sales and stuff, but what I can't bother with is uh, manually typing out addresses. It drives me insane. Right, let's get John's stuff done. Now, I'm just reading John's email here that he sent me regarding the trousers and things as well. He has sent me a link to his eBay store, but I don't know if he wants me to share it or not. So, John, if you're watching this, mate, let me know and I will share your eBay store in an upcoming video. Now that's all the parcels done. Oh, the curse of the must do it in one go. Attitude. I think what I'm gonna do now is have a quick tidy up in here because it's getting a bit shitty. It's getting a bit on top of itself. I've had a very busy few days, like the last week. So I've let things slip a little bit. But I do want to get this clock up, actually. So I'm going to do that now. Need a battery. Try and get this out of here. It's a bit tricky. That was a bit difficult, wasn't it? Let's have a look at it with the plug-in and see if it's too hard to like, manoeuvre around here. I don't want wires everywhere, basically. I probably will just be using the thingy. <gasps> it's blue! I wonder if you can do different colours. Okay, let's set the time, because it's asking me to set the time. 10.19. That's how you do an alarm. I don't want an alarm. Should I set an alarm for 11.14? Right, temperature. Let's peel the protective skin off first. Temperature, 22 degrees. Put it up there for a time being. It's not going to stay there until I get batteries. Once I get some batteries, I'll put it somewhere else. Well, I think John, I actually used my brain and I messaged John with the tracking number and said, do you want me to share your eBay account? You know, like an absolute genius. I just wanted to show you mine because we've all seen yours. But if you want to pop a mention up of my Humble collection, I'll leave it up to you. Of course, bro. Listen, Humble is great. All these big super sellers, it's fantastic to watch. It's great motivation and it's a good target to have. But I've seen a lot of people flogging themselves trying to get there then beating themselves up when they get nowhere near. Especially when they don't get nowhere near there overnight. That's not how this game works. Humble's good. I've only got a hundred and something items on my eBay store. I'm not a big seller. I don't work like that. I work on get it in, get it on, get it gone. You might only see four or five sales a day when I do the daily uploads, but that adds up to like 25, 30, 35 sales a week. Sometimes it's more than that, sometimes it's less. A bit on vintage and a bit on private. And I'm also doing deals outside of all this as well. I'm not flogging myself or stressing myself out. 
I would love to have a massive warehouse, like big multi-million pound turning over business where I've got employees and staff, etc., etc. But 120 odd items at the minute, it's fine for me, bro. It's should and it should be fine for you lot as well. All right, let's sort this place out because it's gross. Look, 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 look. My bad habits lead to you. Actually, I want to play some music. Alexa, play Hopsin. To only listen to Hopsin, you'll need Amazon Music Unlimited on your current preferred device. It's five pounds and ninety nine pence a month until you cancel. Terms in the Alexa app. Should I sign you up and play Hopsin? No. Okay. I need to bring my other Alexa in here because that one's got the plans and stuff on it. Amazon Music Unlimited. Shuffling Hopsin. See you in a week's time. I do a labour, yeah. Uh, well, I've had a package. I do believe this is from Top Clobber. I think it's from his YouTube, not YouTube, his whatnot stream. I always buy something from there. Let's see what I brought. No, I'm not going to say that. So I've got a Guinness fleece. I bought it because it was triple XL, and it's I've never seen this logo before. It's a, it's a modern one. Oh. Isn't that smart, eh? It's like a really soft shell fleece, triple XL, but I think I paid, actually no, it cost me nothing. I used store credit on that. And then this I paid £3.25 for because I had to pay for postage, but again, it was free. England, England, dumb bro, are you dumb bro? Look at that, smart. Took a gamble, hoping it's gonna fit. I'm not 100% sure it will. If it does, it's a keeper. If it doesn't, I'll sell it to one of you lot. Or I'll put it on Vinny. Cheers, Rick. The other Rick, obviously. I was actually hoping to go and drop those parcels off and nip into the Chazza before I have to be back to pick Ada up. But unfortunately, I'm not going to have time. It's now 10.30. need to go inside, have something to eat, and then be time to go and pick her up again. So I'll see you in a bit. Can't really see it in this light. Looks good, though. Where are we coming to? Yes. That's some food and crack on, yeah? Get that done? Way. Where are we going to go? Yep. Toy shop. <laughs> Ladies first. Here you get them. You alright? Yeah, I think so. Oh, I'm slamming the door. Say hello. Hi. We've already found someone to look in there. Already. What did I just say to you? We'll have a look at the end. Hold on to it and I'll tell you at the end because I know what's going to happen. You're going to find more stuff that you're going to want. Stop going on. Go and have a look. What do you care about what the price is? What does it matter? 125 What does it matter? Will I buy it? It's not about the price. It's about what you're going to buy later. Just hold on to it. Will I buy it? Yes. I'm going to take it. And we are back. Got some little cakes for me to have in a minute. She's in there going to the toilet. So charity shop pickups, little teddy bear for her, £1.25, absolute rip off. I've got three of them sitting down there, but she couldn't wait. And some Estee Lauder white linen. I'd say an 80% full bottle, £2.50. Should be 20 quid back on that. It smells very floral, that classic floral smell. Oh, well, I've had a package arrive as well today, and I know exactly who this is from, because I'm expecting it. Very Christmassy rummage around card. I saw this in his video, and I messaged him and said, I must have that. He only charged me 20 quid, so he done me a really good deal. Look at that. How sick is that? So, it's the 25 year or something. What did you say it was, Kieran? I can't remember now. But it's got embroidery on print. 2022 tour thing, I don't know. That's the back hit. Kieran's worn this before. I'll put it on now, but I've got no reason to wear it right now. I haven't got the right outfit. But yeah, how cool is that? He paid seven, I paid 20. After fees, he's probably made a tenner on top. Kieran, appreciate the deal, appreciate the business. I'm sure most of you know who Rummage Around is on YouTube by now, but if not, Rummage Around is on YouTube and he's already getting Christmas ready. Daddy, Ada, what are you doing, darling? Let's show you a crappy toy that you bought. Look, what is that? Neely. Neely. 
Nee Lee, like Ricky Lee, Ada Lee, Nee Lee. You got chocolate, you got sauce on your face. Well, you've got the cakes. We've done that. Yeah. I can't get much else work done today, can I? Because of your hair. I've got to go and entertain you now. We're going to do a little bit of drawing. Oh, yeah. yeah I've opened it already. Oh, I've got all my change for the car boot sale earlier. Two pound coins, one pound coins, and 50 p's. We've got loads because it's Saturday tomorrow. So I'm hoping I can get to a boot sale. Well, no, I can. I've got no kids or wife. Mrs. Not wife. But as always, I appreciate you for watching this mishmashy type video. Me and Ada are going to go off now and do some colouring. Yes. Thank you so much for yes, watching. I'll get set off mommy. Okay. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye. <laughs>